yo 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 what's up welcome to my youtube channel please subscribe if you walk up to any medical student right now and tell them that you want to do medicine the first thing they're going to do is laugh at you not because they don't think you can make it but because they know what goes on in med school so welcome to my channel today i'm going to be telling you everything you need to study medicine in zambia over to you sticky Thank you, Slim Joe. Thank you very much. We look at five aspects of med school in Zambia. The application process, the price, duration, student life, and tips on how to make it in med school. So let's start with the obvious question. What is med school, you know? Med school, also known as a school of medicine, is responsible for training individuals to become doctors and healthcare professionals. We'll take a look at three different universities in this video. The University of Lusaka, commonly known as Unilas, the University of Zambia, commonly known as Unza, and Cavendish University. To help us understand more, let's take it to the next guy. Yo, it's your boy Hot Dog. Oh, sorry, you guys don't know me. Hi, I'm Hot Dog, and I'm going to be talking about the application process to getting into med school. So, what you want to know is you need good grades, like. <laughs> You need your grades to be like A's and A stars. Well, you can get in with C's, but the reason why I'm saying you need your A's and A stars is for you to get a chance to apply for a scholarship, you know? The scholarship people, they only give students with A's and A stars. So if you don't have those A's, the chances that you get a scholarship from these institutions is really slim. Well, let's say you don't have money, to pay for medicine but you really want to do medicine uh, you can apply for a student loan but usually these student loans are issued by the government institutions and not the private institutions so if you want to go to a private institution and you don't have the funds your best hope is a scholarship otherwise there is no hope unfortunately so Mr. Slim Joe is going to come back and explain the prices. You feel me? Yo, 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 it's Slim Joe. Let's talk about the price. So med school is really expensive, especially in places like Europe and the US. But in Zambia, uh, it's, it's also expensive, you know. But I'm going to be talking about the top three universities that we have for med school in Zambia, which, they, which is the University of Zambia the University of Lusaka and Cavendish University. So these three universities, they can start from anywhere between uh, $600 or they were up to like $3,000 per year. And taking note, this is only for tuition fee. This does not include accommodation. It also does not include other things. So this is just tuition. And the fees can increase as you further up your studies, as you enter other years, for example, in your first year, you can pay like $1,000. Then when you go into your second year, it's like $1,300. So depending on the institution that you want to pursue, you might want to research on that. But the basis is it's not less than $500. It is way more than $500 for our top three universities. Hi, it's Slim Joe again. So, I just want to say if you're enjoying the video so far, please like, subscribe, you know. It takes a lot of time and effort to make these videos and animate them. So, if you subscribe, it will mean so much to me. Please help by subscribing. Okay, let's get into the duration. How long is it? So, in Zambia, medicine is not less than six years. But for you to start this program, you have to start another program called Foundation or Natural Sciences or A-Levels, which is generally like one year. And some institutions might be two years, so you really need to do your research before you pick an institution. Um, so I'm going to be breaking it down. So at the University of Zambia, the entire program, including Natural Sciences, it's seven years. And at Cavendish, it's also seven years. However, at Unilus, it's six years plus six months to do the entire program, including um, 
natural sciences. Then there's this one sketchy university uh, called Texila American University. And for them, it's six years for everything. I don't know how they do that, but they do it anyway. So you need to do your research if you want to do medicine. But if you want to do medicine, these are the top three that you want to do. Medicine from the University of Lusaka, Cavendish, or the University of Zambia. All right, so that's just doing the program. Uh, after you graduate, you're now a doctor. You need to work on your license. So you need to get a license, which can take like one year. Uh, so we have a total of like eight years. And then you also have to specialize, if you want to specialize into a particular route, like uh, a neurosurgeon, cardiac surgeon. And specializing is not less than three years. So that's plus another three years. So if you really want to do medicine, you're really just giving your life away to save others. But, you know, you have to have the passion to do what you love. If truly it's what you love. So, yeah, this comes to a total of more than 10 years. If you do your license stuff plus specializing, yeah, that's like 10 years or more. So you really need to be decided if you're going to do medicine. You have to be sure this is what you want before you get into the medicine program. All right, it's Slim Joe again. So let's talk about the student life. All right, so we're going to talk about the three universities that we've been talking about, starting the University of Zambia. The University of Zambia does offer accommodation, and the prices can start anywhere from $400 for the entire semester. However, this accommodation is really sketchy because sometimes you're not even paying directly to the institution. There's like a middleman that is, you know, getting rent. And yeah, it's really, really sketchy, but it's it's a cool experience. Eh? You want to test the waters? Go to the University of Zambia. Next, we have the University of Lusaka. They have the best accommodation, in my opinion. And the prices start from anywhere from $400 going up because they have different options for like four people in a room, two people in a room, or by yourself, you know, all those options. So if you love luxury, you love living a, a soft life, go to the University of Lusaka. However, if you want to be an ultimate survivor, go to Cavendish because they don't have any accommodation whatsoever. You got to be a survivor because you need to find a boarding house when you find a house or an apartment that you can rent in order for you to survive. Because I guarantee you, you will not find accommodation at Cavendish. So if you want to be a parent, you want to be a bushman, you want to be that guy, you know, go to Cavendish or go to the University of Zambia because it's somehow similar. These two institutions will make you a parent. Uh, if you want to be, you know, the rich kid, Survive, uh, yeah, the rich kid go to the University of Lusaka, commonly known as Unilus. All right, all right, uh, it's your boy God. We hope you enjoyed your stay on this channel. We hope you liked the video. If you did, please subscribe, give us a like. You know, we're gonna make more of these videos for entertainment and also for information. So yeah support us you know one zambia one nation